It's showtime, Carriage Conversations with Christian Perry, your favorite real estate choreographer. I have a very special guest today, Lisa Anastas, your expert on Aston Martins over at Miller Motors. Come join us for a fun ride. Coughlin Insurance, relationship driven since 1947. So Lisa, thanks for joining me on A Carriage Conversation. I'm so happy you've joined us because we have uh, had to speak with anybody who's in the car industry and we have so many clients that live here and many clients that are moving here are scoping out the area and they drive right by you guys at Miller Motors, Aston Martin. My pleasure to join you. Thank you so much for having me. It's a beautiful brand. Yes, at Miller, we are experts at what we do. We are very passionate um, and very much embedded in our brand, each individual salesperson. So I've been with the brand for seven years um, under, you know, under Cindy Koppelman, which is certainly the Queen of Aston Martin uh, on, on the East Coast. I've heard her name many times. <laughs> yes. I would, I would fancy to say that I'm her protege. So becoming a part of the brand for the first year, uh, a lot to take in. It is a embedded, you know, this is a brand embedded in racing heritage. Uh, went to England, saw the factory, um, you know, met all the factory workers and got really into the brand and how they make these cars. Now, is it true they are handmade? They are handmade, wow. yeah. There is only one robot in the factory, um, and his name is James Bonder. Uh. <laughs> Not a lot of people know that. We aerospace bond our chassis, and that's actually very, very special in the exotic industry and the car industry. So most of the cars you see driving around, they take about 15 to 45 hours to make from start to finish on a conveyor belt. Being handmade is that exact term. Wow. So there. So every Aston Martin I see is handmade. Yes. Yes. Incredible. Yeah, it is. It is an incredible, incredible thing. So, you know, and most of those factory workers have been with the brand for over 10, 15 years. So they are experts at what they do. If someone comes to town, say it's a new mm -hmm. client of mine, I just sold them a house. Mm -hmm. How can they find you? So email, texting is obviously, if you're comfortable texting, very easy to get in touch with me. Um, as far as the showroom's concerned, nine to six every day. Uh, Sunday we're closed, nine to four on Saturday. So please come by, visit, bring your kids. Uh, we love to share the Aston Martin brand. Like I said, we're very, very passionate about what we do. And our clients are very passionate about Aston Martin. Now, all of our I Love Greenwich fans, you just got our personal cell phone, so use it. <laughs> and now- For cars. Exactly. <laughs> so you mentioned this as a brand, a certain type of brand. What, what yes. how would you verbalize it? That's a very good question. So a lot of my clients that are new to the brand for the first time like to come in and, and maybe, you know, they're new to it, they're unsure, they don't know a lot about it. So I love to share our heritage, our racing heritage, and what type of client fits perfectly with our Because it is the brand. James Bond car, isn't it? Yes, it is. <laughs> How yes, cool it is. That? We fly underneath the radar. We are kind of known as a gentleman's sports car brand. So our clients are down to earth. They are hardworking professionals. Um, and first and foremost, they're sports car enthusiasts. So we have something for everybody, every type of driver. We even have a brand new SUV. Um, which now, is see, that's something that interests me. I, I have Versailles here and I want to take them on trips. I need it to pull a trailer. Oh, that's what I was going to ask you. Yes. Do your SUVs, what's their towing capability? Yeah, so towing capability is four tons. Wow, um, that's plenty. So horse carriage for Versailles, right? For Versailles Very or fancy. Buddy. <laughs> Very fancy horse towing. Thank you. This is my right? one horsepower. <laughs> yeah. I love Greenwich brand of car. Yeah. Now this is, by the way, a carriage that we're in, which is the original name of the word car, carriage, car ridge. FYI, for those of you that don't know, and the first car was actually called a uh, motorless carriage. Yes, yeah, it FYI. absolutely was. And now that you bring up a little bit of a heritage, I like to share some background information about Aston. Please do. Um, and not a lot of people know about it. So Lionel Martin, right, and Robert Bamford were the two gentlemen that started Aston Martin in a barn. Wow. And the, the, I love Aston for their MO. Their MO was just to build the most beautiful gentleman's sports cars and racing. They just wanted to race. So Aston Hill Climb, right, back during those cars that kind of looked like, you know, Model Ts, right? They probably had minimal horsepower. So the goal was just to get up the hill. 
<laughs> ah. So they looked at each other and they say, I'm having so much fun. How do we do this for a living? <laughs> so they said, let's build some cars. So they started in a barn in Newport Pagno. And Lionel's wife said, I have a great idea. It should be called Aston after the Aston Hill Klein. And it should start with an A. So it's at the top of the phone book. Good so idea. Aston Good marketing. Martin, exactly, right? Easy to find in the phone book. And they just started building cars and racing cars. So not a lot of people know that our racing heritage precedes Ferrari by 40 years. So what kind of cars do you have? So you have coupes, or what, what do you call them? The sedans? Yeah, so we have we have a model lineup currently. We have the Vantage, which is the two-seater coupe and roadster. Mm -hmm. That's the term for convertible. Mm -hmm. That is our two-seater tight rakish aggressive chassis, right? For someone that really wants to bang gears. Um, we also have manual uh, transmissions, which is very rare for an exotic industry. Um, the next model, which is what I brought to your house, is the DB11 Volante. That's our most elegant chassis. Um, DB, right, is James Bond's car. Oh, right. okay. Um, there is also some history. I won't bore you to death with too much history, but... I think, I think our viewers love this. <laughs> DB has a huge long-standing history of why we call it a DB. Um, and then above the DB11 is its wicked sister, and that is the DBS Superleggera. So that's our halo car. Um, it's a V12, so it has 715 horsepower and 664 pound-feet of torque, so very aggressive. Wow. And then we also have the DBX, which is our SUV. Um, so for people that, you know, want that capability of all-wheel drive, uh, more of a workhorse, Aston Martin, right? Just like Versailles. Just like Versailles. <laughs> no pun intended. Good job, buddy. Keep it going. <laughs> So yeah, we have something for everybody, but the people that love us the most are car enthusiasts. Well, it's a beautiful brand and everybody should stop in to Miller Motors. What do you got? What are you located next to? Just so people are aware so of where you are. So we are in 273 West Putnam Avenue. So that's between, you have Dunkin' Donuts and Mercedes. Yep. And then you have our other brands, uh, Bentley, Rolls-Royce, Pagani, Bugatti. Ferrari, McLaren, Alfa Romeo, and Maserati. So I think what's also great about that is that once you become part of our family, almost like our fraternity, you get to choose from I like 10 that. different brands. Your fraternity or sorority. Yes, yep, exactly. Right? Isn't that uh, what you guys feel truly there? Absolutely, we, we love our female and male clients. Uh, like I said, people that are passionate about sports cars want to enjoy that on the weekends. Um, sometimes people use it as an everyday car. Now, how about leasing and purchasing? Is that is that a big topic for you guys? Um, you know, yes it is. I think people that are getting into the brand for the first time, uh, they like the leasing capabilities of kind of, I like to say kind of dating it, not marrying it. Sure. Um, trying it on. And I always tell my clients, once you get involved with a brand like this, you're never gonna wanna get out of so it. So Lisa, I notice it's rare to see a female on the floor. <laughs> and I love that you're here doing this interview with me. I think that's one of the reasons why I wanted you on the carriage is to let people know, hey, listen, this car is, although it is branded a gentleman's sports car, I mean, it, is, it looks just fabulous on a female. And it's, I'm, I'm excited to see that you're very involved in the sales aspect also. Yes, yes. I, I have such a amazing passion for the brand. I think because I love cars. I was raised loving cars. That's great. And the benefit of it all, I have a really passionate, wonderful female boss. So it's very family-oriented, family-run business. Um, and you know, her being passionate, I'm so lucky to have that with, with, uh, with Miller Motor Cars. Oh, that's awesome. Well, well yeah. thank you for joining me on the yes. Carriage Conversation. Thank you. Everybody, you know how to reach her. <laughs> yes. She's amazing. Now that you're in Greenwich, you now know Lisa. And that's yes. the point. Go in, say hello, and have her show you around. Yes. Thanks again. My pleasure. Thank All right, you. everybody, Thanks, I'm Christian. your real estate choreographer, Christian Perry, helping you with your best moves. We'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye,